This is a measure of Frank's Collins data plotter. So we have our vertical axis and our horizontal axis. And our vertical axis, our f of x in this case, is actually our energy, the electron volts. And our horizontal axis is our frequency. So hertz for inverse seconds. Okay. So we have our data points. We need that maybe. And we draw our line through our points, the line of S bit. Now our energy equals HF, which equals the kinetic energy of the electron minus the work function. Now, the work function is our intercept. So this is our work function. Okay, it's our intercept, which you might have seen in the other videos. Okay, so now we have HF equals to, okay, the voltage comes to charge the electron minus the work function. It's the kinetic energy of the electron, it's the voltage of uh, the applied through times the charge of the electron. So if we want Planck's constant by itself, it's H, it's the voltage, times the charge of the electron, minus the work function divided by the frequency. Okay. Now, we have all of these values before. We get our work function from our graph, our frequency, which we get, okay, or we know, it's like a wave, C equals frequency times the wavelength, so F equals C divided by lambda, so sign off for to get the frequency, so we have all these values, so we sub it in, we find out our value of Planck's constant, now all you have to do is error analysis, and you're done.